Firstly, Shafat has still never won, but he has no problem taking credit for Johnny Banana's win on Total Madness. Wait, what? Hello, fellow couch potatoes. Welcome to today's video. The Challenge 37 was another disappointing one for Fessy. Fessy talks the talk, but he has yet to walk the walk. Season 37 ended up being another underwhelming one for Fessy as he has still never won, but he has no problem taking credit for Johnny Bananas. Fessy admits he broke the rules on the challenge. There are two golden rules in the challenge and that is if you quit, the producers will never invite you back to play again and if you fight, you're out. Fessy says the incident should have never happened, especially with his friend. He explained that the first night out of the house was hard because he was thinking over everything and things were tough. But once he got home, he had peace of mind with it because as much as it sucked that he got kicked off, it was all under his control. Fessy said, I could have controlled my actions better and still be there. This was Fessy's first time competing on the challenge where he didn't make the final. And he thinks if he would have stayed in the competition and that he would have made it again to the finals and won the whole thing. Fessy said, I heard stuff about the way the season played out with me not being there and the way my cast members and my friends made it seem like this would have been a good season for me, so it's tough. During a recent appearance on Johnny Banana's podcast, Death, Texas and Bananas, the challenge goat asked Fessy which one of his accolades he is most proud of. He replied, Definitely not you beating me in a final. Not that one. When Bananas noted that Fessy made the final in his first season Total Madness and that's a whole lot more than most people can say, Fessy claimed he gave Banana the final. When the GOAT doubted Fessy's response, Fessy backtracked a little. Not gave it to you. Fessy said, after the math problem, that show was like 30 or 40 minutes left. I don't know. I thought that show was gonna be all day. Fessy says he wanted to win one real quick and admits that it was hard getting kicked off season 37, but he says he's definitely learned a lot. He says that in his third season of competing, his castmates finally got to know him and understand him a little more which is something he's grateful for. During his rookie year on the challenge, competing against Banana, he just wanted to win no matter what. My first two seasons, I came in as a rookie and I didn't really know anybody. Everybody was already clicked up, so I just wanted to try to win one real quick. I was hell-bent on winning the whole thing and I was going to do whatever it took. And now, my third season, I'm starting to see the backlash from it. Fessy got a better grasp of the challenge after three seasons. Fessy says it doesn't matter how his gameplay gets shown on TV, no matter what kind of edit he gets. What's important to him is the people on... What's important to him is that the people he works with on the challenge knows how he plays. We're all there to win a lot of money, so you've got to do certain things in the game if you want to be successful, Fessy explained. With me coming in so early and trying to make all these moves and waves, it's ruffled a lot of feathers and now I'm seeing that. But that's how I play anything in life, any competition I play to win. Fessy says people didn't reciprocate his energy during his first two seasons and some of his castmates maybe got the wrong idea about him, but there's nothing he can do about that now. I definitely feel like I got a better grasp on the game and my castmates are now moving forward, if I were to come back, Fessy says. Do you agree that we the fans don't reciprocate his energy? Last season, he was complaining about his partnerships and we were complaining about how he blames being an introvert on almost everything. That's reciprocation. This season, we saw lack of strategic planning, 
but we applaud him and Esther on all their wins. So we do appreciate and acknowledge the growth. What do you think of Faces' gameplay this season? Let me know your thoughts in the comment section below. Thank you for watching. Hey, Couch Potato, thank you for watching. Click like and subscribe. See you on the next video. Bye.